summer vacation is coming to an end. Back to school is right around the corner. So I wanted to help one lucky winner be a little bit more prepared. Today, like the title, I am doing a back to school giveaway. So I did one last year, it was a lot of fun. I actually had two going on last year. I had a kind of like a more girly version and then my husband picked out some more boy items. But this year, just going to be one, but I did pick up quite a few gift cards. So I went shopping for basically myself. I picked out things that I would have loved to have, things that I was drawn to if I was still in school. So definitely you guys will see that. It's definitely going to reflect me. However, in case you this is not your style or you have a boy who just doesn't want to take flower stuff to school, then I have some gift cards. So I'm going to show you guys everything and then I will let you know how to enter. First up is the backpack. I got this at Target. It actually has a padded laptop pocket inside as well. So as you can tell, it is very flowery. It has flowers all over it. It's called the Double Dutch Club Backpack in Blue Floral. And it does come with a little notebook attached here as well. I'll show you guys the back. It's got like a mesh lining on the back and nice padded straps, lots of pockets as well. So to go with the backpack, I did pick up a lunchbox. This was from Target as well and I should have looked at them together because they were not sitting together. They were on completely different aisles. However, I thought this was exactly the same as the backpack. But when I got home and I was unpacking everything, I looked at it and I was like, okay, no, that looks completely different, but it's still really pretty. I love it. It's got the same kind of blue color and floral. It's just a different color combination. So this is the lunch box. It does have a pocket on the front and then it has a little tag area in the back where you can personalize it just in case you lose it. And this is by Igloo and it's called Lunch Purse Cooler Bag. So it looks kind of like a purse. It's just a huge open insulated bag. You can probably fit a lot of stuff in there. I love these bigger bags. Okay, so now we're going to get into some of the smaller supplies, organizational items, and I do not have these in any kind of order. I'm just gonna pull them out because they are all stuffed into the backpack and then stuffed into a bin. I went to three stores, Target, Walmart, and the Dollar Tree. I actually did a shop with me at each of the stores. If you guys wanted to see other items they offered, I will have that up in the iCards and down below. But those are the three stores that I went shopping at, so I'll let you know if I remember which item I got at which store. So not all the items are school supplies. I think there's only one other makeup item in here, but I just saw this and I thought, you know what, I'm constantly putting on chapstick when I'm out in public and I don't have lipstick on. So I saw this and I wanted to get it for you guys. I either got this at Target or Walmart. I'm sure it sold at both. I don't remember exactly which one. I picked it up at, but it says new chapstick duo, snap change rearrange. So you could get tons of different scents, flavors, and mix and match them. So if you like the coconut out of this one and like a strawberry out of another one, you can put the coconut and the strawberry together. You're not limited on keeping these two together. And these two are tropical pineapple and fresh coconut. It says eight hour moisture when you put these on. Okay, so now we're getting into some school supplies. This is just 100 sheets of sticky notes and it's a big old coffee cup. I should have picked up one for myself, but if you guys have watched any of my Dollar Tree hauls, you know I have a lot of sticky note pads and I don't necessarily need another one in my life. Want another one? Yes, I love this. I love coffee. So of course I had to pick it up for you guys and this one did come from Walmart. Also from Walmart, you guys, they have stickers for your planner and these were only 88 cents each. That's an awesome price. I mean, that's cheaper than the Dollar Tree and you get quite a few in here. Does it tell me? Um, it just says four sheets. It doesn't say the overall amount of stickers, but here's the first one and it actually has, like I said, four different sheets in there. It only shows me two on the back, so maybe you get two of each of those sheets possibly. Same thing with this one. 
There's four sheets in here and it just shows two of them on the back. So maybe you get two of each sheet, but again, only 88 cents at Walmart and they had different color combinations as well. Got some tape. You guys see the theme I kind of went with, blue and pink, <laughs> but just some normal scotch tape. I always have to have this on hand. And then this was on my wish list for a couple weeks before I finally found it at my Dollar Tree. Oh, and the tape was from Walmart, if I forgot to say that. But this is just a magnetic pouch. I did get one of these for me, and then I got one for you guys. This one says Believe Dream, and the back is just a full magnet sheet. And the front, I don't wanna open it, but it's just a pouch, and it comes out pretty well. So you could put, I don't know if it's heavy duty enough to hold your cell phone in, but you can put pens in here, a notepad that maybe doesn't have a magnetic strip, but you want it on your refrigerator or your locker. But I just thought that was really cute. You could probably keep like a little mirror, compact mirror in here, all sorts of stuff. Okay, I got a office accessory kit. I'm pretty sure I picked this up from Target. It is U Brands. Um, there's 40 pieces in here, and I just loved that it was just food color and or food themed and pastel colors. So there's a pretzel, avocado, donut. I think those are the three. A pretzel, avocado, and donut. There are some paper, a paper pad in here that says "Do not donut forget." But I thought that was super cute. It includes three paper clips, 30 push pins, six large binder clips, and then one notepad. Some organizational items from the Dollar Tree. So this is called a storage box. It includes three swing out drawers and a pencil holder. So these are the drawers right here. And then on the top, there's a small little area where you could keep your bobby pins, push pins, paper clips, and then two separated areas for your pencils. Or you could keep this in the bathroom as, as well. If you're going off to college, you have a dorm, you could put your hair bows and stuff in here. Your toothbrush would probably fit in here or a hairbrush if it's got a small enough handle. All sorts of uses for this organizational item. And then also, same exact color by Jot from the Dollar Tree. This is just a magnetic holder. Again, it's got a really big magnet on the, on the back. So in your home, on your refrigerator, in your dorm, on your mini fridge, or at school in a locker. Lots of uses. It's got four, wait, three. Yeah, one big area and then two relatively smaller areas that you can use to hold items in. I did get a magnetic list pad though, just in case. It's got a really good size magnet on the back and it is floral. I believe this is from Walmart. Might be from Target. I think it's from Walmart, but it just has flowers all over it and it is lined. So you could easily make your grocery list or your any kind of shopping list, taking notes, writing down things, whatever you need this for. Got some scissors. You guys, they had some really cute kid scissors at Target. These are from Walmart, but at Target, they're like color changing. I did show that in my video. I put my hand on it and left it on there for a little while and it changed a different color. Those are kind of cool, but I just went with the like 12 years and older scissors and the pink color. It does have a really soft grip. It, it says it's a squish grip handle for extra comfort. So I picked those up. Then I got some pens and highlighters. I almost got myself these same highlighters. They look really cool and they're erasable. Like seriously, school supplies are, have changed so much since when I was in school. So this is by Crayola, it says take note, highlight or underline, six erasable highlighters, and it is six different colors also. Then the pens I got were Papermate, I like Papermate, um, and it says official box tops educational brand. So if you guys save box tops for your kiddos, they do have a little box tops on the back there. So this is a gel pen and 10. There's 10 different colors in here. It says medium point pens and it does have a comfort grip. It's got a little soft gripper there on the pen. These were too cute. I had to get these. These are from Target and this is UV. One for you, one for me. So this is a brand at Target that, let me see, does it tell me on here? You buy, you be gives, but does it tell me where they give to? Okay, for every UB item you buy, a UB item will be donated to a classroom in need right here in the United States. One for you, one for me, it's that simple. That's really awesome. I bought a lot of this last year. However, when I went to Target, they just didn't have everything put out. 
So I knew I wanted to at least buy one of these products and these erasers were just too cute. So this is a four pack of erasers. It's got two different kinds of ice cream cones. No, one cone, one donut, and two popsicles. They're really good size. Plus they come in this little container, which if you didn't want to use this container for the erasers, you could totally use this for something else. Even like a little snack in your child's lunchbox. That's some more office supplies. So this is a stapler that I believe I got from Walmart. Swing line, a thousand staples included, 12 sheet capacity, built in remover. I love the colors. I love that little peach and like the mint green color in the stapler. Then I got some post-it notes, but I love that this is a note dispenser. So instead of just having the notes that you have to tear off or take off, this one you just pull it out. So it comes, it says one dispenser and then one 50 sheet pack of the post-it notes. So I thought that was really cool. And again, the color combination, anything pink, this one is pink and purple. They had a whole bunch of different color combos and I got this at Walmart. And then a sharpener. This one's super cute. Fiskars Full Lifetime Warranty, world's number one scissors brand. However, this is not scissors. This is a eraser. I mean an eraser. This is a sharpener. It does say pencils and crayons. Fun to use. No mess. Sharpener Designer Flip. So I thought that was super cute. You guys. I had to get this. So this is called a slap ruler, a bracelet and ruler all in one. They had a whole bunch of different combinations. They had unicorn ones. I picked one of those up and I sent it to Kira, my friend over at 50 Shades of Mom here on YouTube. So this is just, you can use it as a ruler. It's very nice and flexible. And the other side has glitter all over it. <laughs> I was totally about to slap it on my hand and it decided to slap instead. I have a watch on this hand, so let's see if I can do it. Otherwise, there we go, there's my bracelet. So you could be styling in school with your school supplies. I got another organizing case. I just love the size of this. I thought it was really neat. It just says jot organizer case, great for organizing office and craft supplies. This was from the Dollar Tree. Now I picked one up to use for my fake nail storage to keep them in because it was bigger. I ended up picking up quite a few of those little toolbox ones that everybody's been using, but I have like four of them. And it, I just figured if I could fit the majority of those four into one, that would be better. So that's what I'm gonna use this for, but I picked one up for you guys as well. That way you could get whatever use you needed to out of it. But I just thought the size of this was really good for storage. I did pick up a couple of notebooks. So this first notebook is from the Dollar Tree. Jot is the brand and it's a composition book, 100 sheets. I love this print. Again, it was just super pretty. I was definitely drawn towards things that I would have picked up for myself if I was still in school. But then I went to Walmart. I was only gonna include one notebook. I was trying to just get one of everything, but I saw this at Walmart and I was like, what? It is scented, so I'm not gonna scratch and sniff this one. I scratch and sniffed one in the store. Unless somebody else did before I came along to this one, I did not scratch this one, so hopefully it lasts as long as possible, although I can smell it. It smells very floral, so I thought that was really cool. It just says perfectly scented, scratch and sniff, and let's see, does it tell me how many? It has 80 sheets, it's a one subject notebook, but I thought that was really cool. And let's see, is it wide rolled? Yeah, wide rolled. I lied, I picked up three notebooks. <laughs> one from each store, Walmart, Dollar Tree. This one is from Target. I just thought it was really pretty. I love the cacti all over it. Again, this is a one subject by Green Room and there's 70 sheets in here. And this one is college rolled. So you've got a wide rolled, a college rolled and a composition notebook. All right, you guys, so when I first started seeing school supplies come out in the stores, this was kind of my inspiration for shopping for this giveaway. I saw this print at the Dollar Tree and I just fell in love with it. I totally would have picked a set up for myself if I needed it, but I already have so many supplies here that I just didn't need it. So I was like, you know what? I'm gonna go shopping with this as my theme in mind for a giveaway. So again, this is from the Dollar Tree. It is Jot, the brand. It's a one inch three ring binder. This is the flexible binder. So it just has the rings. There's no pockets or anything, just super soft and flexible. But oh, I just loved the color and the print on this. 
So to go with that, they do have a hard binder. So this is again by Jot One Inch Three Ring and it says durable plastic. This does have the pockets inside. I love the blush baby pink color. Normally I don't go for pink stuff. I'm definitely more on the blue side, but I just love the pink and the blue together. This one does say love on the front, just the floral print on the back. And of course, I tried to pick up everything that I could find in that print at the Dollar Tree. So I picked up the clipboard. This is a small clipboard. It's seven and a half inches by 10, a little over 10 and a half inches. So not a full, you know, sheet of paper or anything like that. It would be a little bit too small for that. But for note size papers, I thought it was pretty. It doesn't have the floral print all over. Instead, the big flower print is on the middle and then it has this kind of plaid gingham print going on on the background and on the back. Same thing with this, kind of taking the floral, just making it bigger. And this is a dry erase board by Jot. Just says stylish border print, but I thought it was super cute. You could use this for a lot of different things. You could totally add your magnet on the back if you wanted to put this on your refrigerator or a magnet board, anything like that. And then I totally should have picked one of these up for myself because I need something to store my planner stickers in. But I saw this and I was like, yep, that's for the giveaway. It's a different blue. It's kind of like a baby blue, not really a turquoise or a teal, but I did love the pink flowers on it. This is from Walmart and it is letter size expanding file and it has seven pockets in here. So let me show you that. It's got expanding seven different slots, pockets in there for you. And then I've got this full of stuff. So I had to go ahead and pick up a photo album. This is from the Dollar Tree. It's just with each new year, that is an opportunity to make more memories. So I just wanted to get a photo album to go with this giveaway. It holds, does it tell me how many it holds? Maybe it tells me on here. It holds 24 four by six photos. And again, I just went for the color combination on here. It's almost like a watercolor polka dots all over it. Also from the Dollar Tree, I got these folders. So these are called pocket folders. They are by Jot. So it is a folder. It's got the two sleeves on the inside, the two pockets. But then on the outside, this is another pocket that you can just open and do that however this is not see-through so you really couldn't make this your like cover for the folder or anything you could just use this to hold extra papers or anything like that so i went ahead and got two of course i got the pink one and then the teal one i almost forgot about this this was another thing at the dollar tree in that print and this is just a pencil pouch but it's got the grommets on here so you could put it in a notebook and then I like that it has this as a zipper instead of just a metal zipper. I thought that was different. So it just opens, it's a really nice size. So I got that to match with the notebooks. Then I got some sheet protectors, you never know. You could totally use one of those notebooks for anything. It doesn't have to be for school. It could be for a recipe binder or your schedule, anything like that. So I got these sheet protectors, there's 16 in here. This is by the brand Jot and these are from the Dollar Tree. I got a pen just because I thought it was cute and I feel like everybody needs some kind of novelty pin in their life. It just, if you are like doing your budget or if you love your budget, if you're doing something that you hate, if you hate to meal plan, use a novelty pen when you're doing it and it just makes it a little bit more fun. So I picked this one up from the Dollar Tree, thought it was super cute. And here's the other makeup item. I knew I got one more. So this is the LA Colors Conceal Correct cover dark spots or circles um, in peach. So it's like a nude color, skin color. Um, but I picked that up just because, you know, if you are in school or even if you're a mom and your kids are in school and you've got those late nights, early mornings, if you're like me, dark circles are permanent on my face. And I definitely need some concealer in my life. So I figured maybe you do too. So I got some. All right, you guys, I picked one of these up for me and one of these up for you because I just love it. Now, it doesn't say the entire saying that I love, which is enjoy the little things. You just sometimes, even on the worst day, you just have to focus on the little things, the good things, whatever happens that you do not 
pay attention to the bad. There's always something that you can look forward to. So I got this one. It just says little things, meaning it's a box to store little items in, but it just made me think of enjoy the little things. So I had to pick it up. It's got a gold metallic polka dots. Little things is in glitter. And this is just a pencil box from the Dollar Tree. Just easy open. I don't feel like it's super, oh, I don't know. It's kind of hard to open. Oh no. I think this would open super easy. So don't put something too heavy in it to where if you're picking it up, not like this, I feel like it would open and spill everywhere. But I don't know. I'm sure you guys could find some use for it. I did get a small notebook. So these are the size that I like to keep in my purse or just around the house in various rooms in case I need to write something down. But I thought this was really pretty. I love the watercolor look it has, the color combination, and just plain and simple, it just says notebook. It has 60 sheets in here. The sheets are five by seven, and this is from the Dollar Tree, and they are just nicely lined. Also, I thought this was so pretty. I just love it. Like, I wish they had this kind of index card set when I was in school. I just thought it was so pretty. So this is by Jot, again, from the Dollar Tree. Index cards, there's 50 in here. They are three by five. They have this little band to keep them together. And then they are on a little ring here. Oh, I just, I love it. I love it, I love it, I love it. And then it says, life is, wait, what does it say? Life, it's my favorite adventure. I thought that was really pretty. Then I got this bin. I love these bins. Gosh, I cannot wait until I move. If you guys did not know, I do have a vlog channel where we are in the process of downsizing tremendously and moving and we're sharing all of that on the vlog channel. That's listed in the description. But I really like these bins. I have one in my life right now. Like I said, I hope we move before these go out from the Dollar Tree because I don't wanna go crazy buying a whole bunch of stuff and not end up using them. But these are great for storage, not only for books, but for papers, for, I mean, you could use this for anything. I am currently using it for my children's books. I like to have one for like library books. That way you keep them in their own container and you don't get them mixed in with your other books. Just, I love these for organizing, especially if you are a teacher. I feel like you could use these for different subjects in your classroom, but they had different colors. This one, of course, is the one that I picked up. Then I did get a planner. I wanted to get a bigger planner, but Everybody plans differently, so I figured it was just safer for me to pick this one up. It is from the Dollar Tree. This is a student monthly planner, 2018 to 2019. Again, I love the color combination on here. And let's see, it says this planner belongs to, it has a spot for personal information. It has the 2018 and 2019 calendar. Dates to remember, a planning guide. That's kind of cool. And then it is monthly. Is it weekly as well or is it just monthly? It's just monthly. So it goes from July 2018 to June 2019. I know you guys won't be getting this until August, but typically schools start in August. So I felt like this was an okay time to do this giveaway. And then it also has a 2019 planning guide. So you can go ahead and start planning out more of your 2019. It's got holidays, postal abbreviations, and then a personal directory in the back. So I thought that was really cool. And because people are so particular about planners, I wanted to have at least one in this giveaway. So I thought just a monthly one at a glance would be my best fit. Okay, and last but not least are the gift cards. So since I did go to three different stores, I got a $25 gift card from each of those stores. So there's one from Target, there's one from Walmart, and there's one from the Dollar Tree. And actually, I'm pretty sure Target said it was scratch and sniff also, the gift card. So whoever wins, if you guys wanna give it a scratch and a sniff, more power to you, go ahead, feel free. But I did get $25 each, so that's $75 in gift cards, just because I know this might not be everybody's, um, so you had a little bit of extra money. I didn't buy glue or markers or anything like that, so I figured you could use this money to buy any school supplies that you still needed, or this would cover like a new backpack or something if you didn't like the one I picked out. So that's it. That is everything included in my back to school giveaway. Now to enter, super, super simple. I love Gleam. They do all the work for me and it makes it easy. All you have to do is that click the link in the description box. Now, there are gonna be a, there's a mandatory, you have to be subscribed. This is for my subscribers. So if you are not subscribed, go ahead and subscribe now because once you click that link, 
that's the first thing it's going to ask you to do is subscribe to my channel so you can get one up on it. Also, if you want bonus entries, just a bet to better your chances to win, there's going to be some extra things down there. Maybe I will have a question that I would like you to answer or watch one of my previous videos. I'm not sure yet. I will figure that out when I set it all up, but it will all be where you just have to click that link and it'll be self-explanatory from there. All right, you guys, so also, this is gonna be a very short giveaway. So today is July 25th. It is Wednesday when this video is going out. And I would like to get this stuff mailed out within the first week of August because I know even though my kiddos don't go back to school until the very last week of August, there are plenty of people who are starting very, very soon, the beginning of August. So I'm only gonna have this go to the end of July. So July 31st is your last day to enter. I will update the title and put closed after July 31st or once I have Glean pick the winner. And I will announce it on my community tab on this channel. So if you guys don't see me posting on the community tab, that might mean that you don't have the bell pressed. So subscribe, there's a little bell next to it. If you hit the bell, you are notified when I post anything, videos or anything on the community tab, you will be notified. So make sure you have that bell pressed so you can see on August 1st when I announce the winner. Also in Gleam, just make sure you put your email address when you're entering, that way I have a way to contact you. So that's it. If you guys love back to school giveaways, give this video a big thumbs up. If you are new, like I said, hit that subscribe button because you will not be able to be entered. If you don't want to enter though, and you just love back to school, make sure you look at some of my other videos. If you like what you see, hit that subscribe button anyway. And I will see you guys in the next video. Good luck. Bye.